Moving to different countries is always difficult. Hello, my name is Diana and today I will tell you how my brother flew completely alone to another country. He used to live with his family in Astana in Kazakhstan, but at the age of 11 he decided that he wanted to fly to another country to study. This was very unusual to hear from a child who was 11 years old and the parents were worried that Daniel would go to another country all alone and would get used to live in a boarding. But after a long conversation, our parents approved it, and Daniel flew to Canada to study at Pickering College in the seventh grade. Pickering College is a very good school that really takes responsibility for each student, provides a good education, and also develops students in sports such as volleyball, football and basketball. My brother, as you can see, loves to eat and he also really liked life in a boarding. Even though he left at the age of 11, he was able to take responsibility for himself and learn uh, how to live all alone hundreds of kilometers from home and overcome the language barrier. So, Daniel, where are you currently studying? Humboldt College. Daniel studying in specialty of engineering. What were the difficulties? It was hard to transfer from Kazakh style of education to Canadian. Why did you decide to move to Canada? Uh, I just wanted to study in better place. What was the most unexpected thing you saw in Canada? Black squirrels. This is what he looked like when he first saw them. Is there any difference between Kazakhstan and Canada? Yes, there is. Different culture, urbanism, mentality, as well different style of education and grading system. Was it hard to find a new friends? No, I had a lot of friends from the start. What was the hardest thing for you? The hardest thing was attending study time for five years. What was your favorite class? My favorite class was Geography. Why did you like Geography the most? It gives a lot of interest and can at the same time useful information. As well, at that class we had a freedom of choosing who or what we want to research. In other classes, sometimes we had the same opportunities, but in Geography my academic interests were perf perfectly fitting with the requirements of the course. Do you want to continue living in Canada? Yes. In 2022, Daniel graduated from Pickering College. He began to travel a little around Canada and visit beautiful places like Niagara Falls. Hello, my name is Diana Miskina. I am Daniel's sister. And I know that you was his favorite teacher. So can you introduce uh, yourself a little bit more? Okay, so I'm uh, Mr. Bishop. I was Daniel's teacher in grade eight but I also knew Daniel when he was in grade seven okay. at the school. Uh, what subject did you teach Daniel? I taught Daniel history and language arts. How did you see his life there, here? Daniel's life was good. He had lots of friends at the school. He's a very funny guy. So Daniel made a lot of friends right away because of his sense of humor. He made other people laugh. He was always joking. With you know what difficulties uh, did he have during his um, study here? Well, getting mostly in English was a challenge because when he arrived to um, to Canada, his English was okay, but he still was learning. What did you rate his study here? I think his study here was really positive. Mm -hmm. Like the things that I remember about Daniel was he enjoyed being here. Like he enjoyed playing sports. I remember coaching him in soccer and he really enjoyed that. Um, so he enjoyed being part of a team. I think he really enjoyed meeting all of the different people he met at the school. What's your first impression of him? My first impression of him? He was, my first impression of him, Daniel was that he was very funny. <laughs> so he's like very sarcastic. He liked playing jokes. Thank yeah. you so much. Yeah, you're welcome. Thank you. Also, Daniel is still remembered and mentioned at Pickering College. Hi. We're on. Hi, Daniel. How you doing? Nice to see you, Daniel. I guess not really see you. Or, Hi, Daniel. Kind of. Daniel's story is very risky and unusual. 
because not every person can give up family care and fly to another country at such an early age.